unevenly balanced. This, ladies and gentlemen, is heat number 18. 51 points to Sweden, 51 to Denmark. Henkel Gustafsson, red, gate three. Mikael Blitz, blue, gate one. Bo Peterson, white, gate two. And Tommy Knutson, yellow and black, gate number four. And away they drive. And into the turn is Bo Peterson. And Gustafsson drives in there. Gustafsson leads for Sweden. Second place is Tommy K. Tommy Knutson now coming up alongside Gustafsson and takes the lead. Tommy Knutson has come through. Gustafsson second. Bo Peterson third. So Denmark are going to snatch victory if it stays this way from the claws of defeat earlier on. Tommy K leads. Gustafsson second. Peterson third. That blitzed in fourth place. Two laps gone and Tommy K coming from the back for Denmark over Henrik Gustafsson. Bo Peterson third, which is very, very important position in this race. Henrik Gustafsson trying everything he knows to make up a bit of ground on Tommy K with one more lap to go in this crucial heat number 18. And the pace is getting fast and furious as Gustafsson comes up to mount a challenge on Tommy K and drives around the outside of it. It's Henrik Gustafsson who takes the lead. Gustafsson around the final two bends of the final heat in Malmo takes the lead and wins this very important race. So Henrik Gustafsson comes through to take the win for Sweden. For Denmark, it's Tommy K second and Buff Peterson third. So after 18 heats of epic speedway here in Malmo, the scores are locked together at 54 points to Sweden, 54 to Denmark. And we'll have to hold our hats off to this young fella. Tremendous skill as he came down the outside of Tommy Knudsen to get the win, which keeps Sweden in the hunt. That means that this test match ends in a draw. So congratulations to Henkel Gustafsson. He must be thrilled with life as the Swedish riders come out and pat him on the back.